depressing and difficult reading uh, going through this report to see what happened and where the mistakes were made in the death of Finlay Bowden, just 10 months old when he died on, the, uh, on Christmas Day, 25th of December, back in 2020, just 39 days after being returned to his parents after being in care. His family were uh, already on the social services radar and reports were already being filed about Finley once they knew uh, about his mother's pregnancy. Uh, he was killed and found with over 130 injuries on his body uh, when he was uh, re reported to hospital on Christmas Day. 57 broken bones, 71 bruises, two burns, showing a catalogue of abuse that had been happening effectively under the radar, according to the report today into the provision of social services uh, to young Finlay. It said that in this instance, a child died as a result of abuse when he should have been one of the most protected children in the local authority area. The review said that while Finlay's parents were responsible for his death, that professional interventions should have protected him. It said the most significant professional decision was that he should live with his parents and concluded that the safeguarding environment in which that decision was made had been incrementally weakened by decisions, actions, circumstances and events which preceded it. Most of what had been experienced by Finley in the final weeks of his life, the report says, was unknown to professionals working with the family at that time. Now, this was at a time when COVID lockdowns were happening and COVID was used as an excuse by the family to avoid social service intervention. Face-to-face -face meetings didn't happen. On occasions when social workers went to the house, they were told that young Finley had COVID or that he was ill and couldn't see them. And many of the assessments were made either virtually or by phone, including some court proceedings. Uh, those are elements which uh, the reporters said need to be addressed. Communication between different departments at one stage uh, instances of domestic violence perpetrated by Stephen Bowden both within this relationship and previous relationship were noted but didn't form part of the decisions that were made in order to return young Finley to his parents a, a, a decision that in the end proved tragically fatal for a 10-month-old baby boy.